The first person to leave this horrific forest wins a luxury holiday. Now, this ain't just any old forest, okay, guys? This forest has a really bad history with multiple murders, which has led to so many people saying they've witnessed the spirits of the victims in the forest. This is a much longer video than usual, though, so please, please let us know right now by liking this video that you want to see longer videos moving forward into the future. <laughs> <gasps> Bro, I just saw something white run, you know. On December the 1st, 1964, a nine-year-old girl called Julia Taylor was lured into a car in Blockswitch by a man claiming to be a friend of her mother. The girl was then sexually assaulted, strangled and left for dead and was only saved from exposure after she was spotted by a passing cyclist. On 12th of January 1966, the bodies of Margaret Reynolds, age 6, and Diana Joyliffe, age 5, were found together in a ditch at Manstead Gully on Canada. Chase in Staffordshire. Reynolds went missing on her way to school in Aston, Birmingham. They were basically found dead in Canic Chase. In 1967, a soldier who was a member of a search party found the sprawled naked body of the seven-year-old Christine Darby one mile away from where Reynolds and Tift were discovered. Christine had been enticed into a car by a strange man near a home in Camden Street, Warsaw, three days earlier. Chase, yeah? Yes. Tonight? Oh, the only girl you know. <laughs> the reason people go there and hide bodies there once they've killed people is because it's so big. What you do is, if a little girl just says your name, bro. If a little girl says my name, I'll slap her, bro. I don't know if I want to do this video anymore, you know, I ain't gonna lie. Should we just do like a blending every flavour of Pringles challenge or something? <laughs> I'm down to just turn our channel into Ollie White, you know. I've got a few little items for us as well, by the way. I packed out a backpack. You and Luke have got a backpack to share with me and feeling or what You packed me and Luke a bag. Yeah, we've all got the same stuff though. I made it fair, don't worry. I didn't actually give you like... No, no, your chat is deep, bro. I know your Nah, nah, I promise you know. I swear down, bro. Five miles deep into the woods and realise there's a Ouija board in your backpack. Yeah, but... <laughs> I'll see you very soon, bro. I'll fight the man, We're leaving about an hour. I'm gonna go pick Luke up and his dirty trim, yeah, that he definitely got from Wix. And we're all gonna be in the car like a happy little family before the two teams break off into their separate own little adventures. And this gets very interesting. Oh, damn, son, I'm excited for this. Here I have two backpacks full of essentials. One for one team, and one for the other team. Roll, batteries, a hammock, this, an eco candle, 24 fire lighters, a barbecue, a sleeping bag, pop-up tent. Let's go. We just arrived. Multiple murders have happened here. Yo, these guys are trying beaky shit early on. I'm actually nervous for this this place. Do you know there's bodies found here yearly because it's that big and like yeah. it's perfect place to hide dead bodies. Bear. Bro, we could have done this at Priory Park, yeah. Why are we doing it here? Well, first of all, if you're doing a Priory Park, I ain't looking to get shanked. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know we have a better survivor right here than Priory Park? <laughs> Here we go, swaying back up to the personal joke. Being shanked by who? By who? Tyler Oakley, no. you just say. Tyler Oakley! Tyler Oakley! Tyler Oakley, do you want to do a bench press competition video between you and Uncle Zogs, yeah? Wait, 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 wait. No. Why are you involving me? Bro, you, you just said me? you wanted to kiss him, bro. On December the 1st, 1964, a nine-year-old called Julia Taylor was lured into a car in Blockswitch. The girl was then sexually assaulted, strangled and left for dead. Was only saved from exposure after she was spotted by a passing cyclist. She was kidnapped in blocks which are basically brought here. Bro, why is the list so long? Have I guessed how many there are? 26. Yeah, was that, was it close? On the 12th of January, 1966, the bodies of Margaret Reynolds, age 6, and Diana Joy Tift, age 5, were found together in a ditch. That way uh, is where we stop walking, and that's kind of where people have been killed. This is Canic Chase. Bro, yo, bro, bro this hood is nice, you know? Bro, you so is yours, bro. This? Oh, yeah. no, no, oh. this ain't. Yeah, I like this, though. That, I like this. Nah, 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 this one. Like our last one. Sold out in 18 minutes. Yeah. In the okay. middle of summer. So I can't even begin to imagine how fast these sell out at Christmas, bro. Along with a one penny 
Kenny theme park entry. What are you talking about? That is That doesn't mad. even exist, bro. That's rumors. You can actually find more information on the TGS store.com. Are you ready for this video? And if bro? you're not going there, suck you, mom. When do these hoodies drop on the 8th of December at 9 pm? 9 pm? Whoa. Are you sure it's not 8 pm? What website is it? TGS store.com. The TGS store.com. I already know who's on my team. Yeah, you too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my <laughs> That? Yo, shut the hell up. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. We put together this backpack for you. Two packs of super doors for you. Got wall. Bro, I thought that was the FBI dude. Serious. <laughs> nah. The FBI in Canada. <laughs> There's a sleeping bag. The one is this, bro. And here's a tent. It's a proper tent. tent. All you have to do is throw it over the M6. Just skim it on the motorway. <laughs> Ramel and Luke are going to have their own vlogging camera. I mean, Phelan are going to have our own camera as well. And we're going to be separating. This forest is absolutely huge. Got another little something for you, you know. Disposable camera. Oh, I remember our last video when we oh, caught those pictures. Do not say. Did you have to throw it like that? Dude, I'm aggressive, man. We're about to enter. Can it chase? Forest man, Yo, this Phelan, what's your favorite biscuit? My yeah. favorite biscuit, yeah. custard Yo, creams. Yo, nah, custard creams are a bit yeah. shanty, Yo, you know. Nah. <laughs> Such a trap. <laughs> 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 Custard creams are that dead, yeah. They make the spirits in here look alive. Yeah. Oh. You lot are pissing me off, you know. You lot are pissing me off. Custard cream, boy. <laughs> Do you know no one eats biscuits down south? The only time you have a biscuit is a custard cream because it's a fucking party. Because it's party food. <laughs> you want custard cream? Custard creams at parties, bro. <laughs> kids, kids parties. Kids parties. Last to leave. This haunted forest wins a luxury holiday. Just cash your votes right now. Who do you think is going to win? Because personally, I think Jay and Phelan are going to win. Because <laughs> I'm sure. Look how dark this trail is. Holy shit, bro. You can't even see down there. Look at that. He's got bourbon creams on his foot. <laughs> oh. oh, really? Oh, really? <laughs> That's your partner. Look at him, bro. You're feeling? <laughs> Not going to lie. I think we might win. Your partner's going crazy, dude. Good luck. Don't die. Don't die. Let's go, man. We have to do this shit. Bro, when you're asleep in the tent, yeah, bro. Don't close your eyes, man. I've got this fetish here where some people's faces do when they're asleep. So where's the holiday destination if you win? Uh, I really want to go to Burundi. Yeah. We're not going Africa. Oh. oh. No. Yo, you're on your own, bro. Define luxury holiday. Italy, Barbados, Plymouth. New Mexico. It's gone thought for five grand you can live for the rest of your life as well. <laughs> And that's sick! <laughs> 5k I'm... holiday, yeah, anywhere in the world. I'm guessing somewhere nice in Spain. Where should we go feeling? I'm thinking like Kazakhstan. Yeah, I don't know, I can kind of smell a bit of uh, Sri Lanka. Bye! 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 Bye. Should we have a look at a proper deep yeah. look around first? Uh -huh. I feel like we could find a really nice spot, you know. Bear with us, we're just going to get to a nice little location. We need a bit of exploring. It could get very interesting because this place is fucking freaky. This place is f***ing weird. We're on our own now, you know. I know, bro. How do you feel? I'm actually feeling quite confident. Where we're walking looks like nothing, bro. Uh, get out. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I feel like Dora the Explorer. Which path should we choose? There's like a green light there. You seeing things? No, bro. Look. Look there. Just concerned about how deep we're going in, that's all. What, you think we're going to get lost? Nah, nah, nah. But like, it's deep, innit? Are you shook, bro? <laughs> no, 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 I'm not shook, bro. Yo, 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 I'm not shook, bro. I think we should keep walking down there, you know. Find somewhere flatter. Yeah, yeah come on. <sighs> They're such idiots, man. Aren't they? <laughs> what? Should we go back to the car? <laughs> yeah, let's go. Yeah, okay. Coming at a crossroads, aren't we, Luke? Yeah, guys, we found a little pathway. We just need to find like a piece of land that's nice and flat so we can pitch a tent. So there's a path there, a path there, yeah. and a path there. Bro, I trust your instinct, bro. Come on, let's go. That is pitch black. That is unreal how dark that is. This is a bit fucked. <sighs> Chemical spraying in progress. Do we really want to camp somewhere where there's chemical spraying going on? Forest, yeah, they have a thing against black people, you know what I'm telling you, bro, don't you think? Bro, we need to find a spot. We could just go back to the car, jack the car and go KFC. They wouldn't know, would they? A mini filler burger. Two of them. Two hot wings. A thigh piece. Oh my god. A thigh piece. Yo, bro, bro, bro. <laughs> sure, set it up. Oh, aren't we going home? 
No, 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 bro, I'm not giving up. We've got this. We're just heading into trees, you know. This is a, this is getting real right now. <gasps> bro, I just saw something white run, you know. We're gonna try. Oh man, this is weird, uh, you know. It's a bit dodgy, yeah. We put blood, sweat, and tears into this tunnel. <laughs> yo, you wanna show us around, bro? Show the views around, okay, bro. So, yo, 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 welcome to my crib. Shut up, just watch. Ten, it? Yo, it looks sick, though. Yeah, Alright, yo. I don't know why it's trees like that. Yeah, just freaking me out. Did you just hear something? Oh, it's racing, bro. It's fucking usual. Nice. Don't worry, bro. Your heart won't be racing when we're in fucking Ibiza down in Sambuca. <laughs> bro, you smell like smoky bacon crisps. <laughs> yo, 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 yo. Who took a shit in the toilet? <laughs> me and Luke are suffering to record. <laughs> 60 years ago now, yeah. People were murdered in this forest and we're just walking around it at night time. Tells me I'm insane a little bit, you know. Shit like this really bothers me, man. Bro, I want this luxury holiday, man. <laughs> The sounds being produced by this forest don't sound friendly, bro. All I'm saying is we eat good tonight, bro. Yo, man, we're chefing, bro. Bro, bro, we're chefing, my guy. Jeez. It's cooking good, my doggy. Why did you... Bro, you... you oh. I've operated. You put out half the thing, bro. So we're just walking through the forest, yeah? And I'm pretty sure that is not just a bunch of branches that have fallen down into that shape. Oh yeah, it's like a circle. With like an A shape for it. You see all the branches are angled inwards and it's a circle. We're just sure do we go that way, that way, that way, or that way. Poor to lose, bro. <laughs> Something's running around, you know. I feel really uncomfortable being out in the open like this. Kind of just want to go home, you know. It is getting so cold. I was like, I wouldn't wear a coat. Like, I'm going to be in a sleeping bag. Like, I'll be nice and warm. I'm frozen. What, are we going to eat the super noodles with you? So I was thinking, yeah, bro. If you, like, get Ramel to, like, run a 14-mile marathon, <laughs> his leg should turn into forks. There is no cutlery, which we're sorry about, but there is a tin. There's also a bottle of water. And if you look deeply somewhere in your bag, you may find a barbecue, fire lighters, and a lighter. Put all that together, and you've got yourself a nice, hearty, warm chicken chicken dinner. <laughs> you geezers grew up in Dudley, yeah. I'm sure you can find a way, bro. So I know you went through that point, yeah, where your mom got lazy and couldn't be asked to wash up, yeah, and you couldn't either, yeah, bro. So you ate your pot noodles with your hands, bro. I'm not even gonna lie, yeah. It got to that stage one time, bro. I ate cereal. Oh yeah, with a knife, bro. <laughs> with a <laughs> knife. <laughs> Yo, that smoke's burning in my eyes, bro. Why are you pretending like everything's okay? <laughs> oh, oh, bro, there's no flame. <laughs> oh no, bro, you just noticed. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, that's pretty big, you know. Ah, oh, dry ground. High gear, single-use disposable barbecue. 450 grams of air. We got wet wipes as well in case we need to shit because we hate really hot noodles today and like our assholes could potentially set a light because of how spicy they were. <laughs> Yo bro, I think I gotta make a sacrifice, you know. I've got my phone case, bro. Yo, you can eat with that, you know. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> bro, bro, bro. Do you know how shit this situation is, bro? Yo, eat my phone case. <laughs> Who's it? Yo, first they laugh, then they join, bro. Yeah. You know what? That was pig. <laughs> yo, yo. I ain't gonna lie, that hit, you know. Yo, <laughs> yes. yo, that hit. Bro. Yo, bro, I came through it. Bro, every time me and you are near a fire, it doesn't end well, you know. <laughs> it doesn't, does it? You guys ever tried smoked super noodles? Never have I, but we're about to try it, man. Oh, it's actually getting a bit warm, you know, isn't it? Bro, you ain't meant to, like, heat up super noodles, yeah, with fire lighters, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that pan. They ain't super noodles anymore. They're mega noodles, bro. <laughs> You're using a walkie-talkie, yeah? That Luke's talking to you from, yeah? To stir noodles. How good, yeah, would a piece of bread be with that, bro? <laughs> Yo, vibes into this, bro. I'm kind of tired, I'm not going to lie. I'm going to go to bed for nine hours, so uh, I'm about to sleep in bag. I have no idea where I'm about to sleep. There's a hammock, bro. I thought that had your name on it, though. <sighs> it's mad how life works. I've got this in my hand. No, bro, bro. 
I'm spooning you, you know, bro. Yeah, why am I the little spoon, bro? My God, it's not the little spoon. All right, how much do you weigh? Bro, now, how much do you weigh? This is getting sick. Now, bro, bro, how much do you weigh? We can't justify Luke, it. how much do you weigh in KG? I haven't weighed myself in a while, but I've put on a bit of pudge. Yeah. Roughly. 16. 16 stone. You fucking liar. No, you don't. Bro, you do not weigh that much. <laughs> bro, bro. You're a liar. You lying piece of shit. <laughs> Gonna get in the tent now, yeah? Tuck into some nice mega noodles that are sponsored by NASA. That's a nice little vibe, you know? Is that comfy? Yeah. We've got our mega noodles. <laughs> as long as I had some mega noodles, yeah. I'm good. Drop the fuck off. Mega noodles. <laughs> oh no, that's hot, bro. I know your lips look like Sandra Bullock, bro. <laughs> Do you know the CEO of mega noodles is gonna DM me tomorrow and what, say. Me then? <laughs> We've got the log, and we've got the tent set up so we can warm our toes. And my feet are in Antarctica right now, dude. You look so comfortable. Yo, I'm coming in there with you, bro. No homo. <laughs> bro, we're running into problems here, you know. We're running out of options here. We're struggling, bro. It's a massive blood clot. Dirty L, bro. <laughs> bro, niggas aren't meant to be out in the wild, nah, you know? nah, nah, Bro, what colour's Bear grow? White. No, black, bro. What? Bear Grylls is black. Do you know how like <laughs> non-eco-friendly apple are? That plastic that's melting right now, <laughs> yeah, it's Romel and Luke are gonna die. That's how poisonous that is. All the trees around them are <laughs> literally trying to Lego, yeah. And then... <laughs> We've run into a problem now. We can't shut the tent. That means we can't keep any heat in. We are gonna struggle now. And when that log goes out, because it's almost been about two hours, we're gonna struggle even more. Such a shit place at the moment. Yo, yo. I'm not a quitter, bro. But this geezer wants to quit badge, you know. <laughs> yo, yo. I'm the only person hanging in on this team, you know. Yo, easy dubs, bro. I've got this easy. On a real, yeah, can we, can we just spend a second to talk about childish and what's happening this Christmas, bro? We haven't spoken about it yet because shit has been getting serious with childish. A lot of work has been going in behind the scenes. It's going to take the entire brand of childish up a completely new level. It's going to raise the bar completely, man. And, like, that's what we want to do. We want to raise the bar. And these hoodies are dropping now for December at 9pm at the TGFstore.com. But this time it isn't just a hoodie. It's going to be an experience. Something is coming along with the hoodie that you guys can take part in. No matter how broke you are, no matter what part of the country you're in, yeah, you are going to be able to be part of this next experience following these hoodies, man. Our last hoodie sold out in 18 minutes, bro. This Christmas, guys, if you want to be part of the childish movement, yeah, you need to grab one of these, man. No, nah, but seriously, though, no, Marilyn Monroe, yeah, you're going to date. Bag it, fam. No, 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 you're going to date, yeah. Portugal. So you go there now, yeah. You go to a restaurant, yeah. She says I'm vegetarian. That would bother me a bit, yeah. But like thinking about this from an entrepreneurial perspective, yeah. More peri chicken for me, you get me. Hold on, Marilyn Monroe. When was her like time? Like 19. 50s? Yeah, you're a vegetarian were a thing then, it? Bro, bro, of course a vegetarian was a thing. <laughs> Vegetarianism's nah, 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 always nah, been a thing. Nah, 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 no, yeah. We're gonna have to call them too, yeah, because like... I'll call be off. I'm getting bare cold. I'll call be off. And Luke just can't be bothered. Are you bleeding something? Bloody handprints. What? I'm not bleeding. And I don't have blood anywhere on me. What the f***? Check that. The f***? That is a bit dodgy. I'm actually comfy. Right, I'm gonna we'll check back in in about 10 minutes. We're gonna try and get some sleep. <laughs> Should I set alarm for like 3 a.m.? We can wake yeah. up then. Bro, honestly, I'm not leaving this forest. <laughs> We're struggling out here, bro. <laughs> <laughs> yo, our zip's broken our tent, yeah. <laughs> Bare cool air's getting in, yeah. Our log's nearly gone out, bro. We're struggling, bro. We don't know what to do anymore. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm actually really warm, bro. <laughs> Trying um maybe try just kissing yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm going to sleep. I don't want to hear your bullshit anymore, man. Fuck off. Even if you had MC Hammer and the 357, Yo, bro, Biggie Smalls, the millions of mansions, the yachts, the two free what? huts, the two hot spots. You're gonna lower the CPM by doing that hood shit around here, man. Yo, you and your cultural appropriation bullshit, yeah. <laughs> Just because we're out in fields and there's no horses, you fucking traveller. <laughs> Did you just call me a jippo? <laughs>
Yo, bro, I'm going back to sleep, man. Just fucking, yo, kiss Luke or something, man. Update, the log's gone. Uh, we are fucked. We're going to lose this army. Bro. Yeah, I don't know why I came, bro. <laughs> <laughs> why am I here? Me and Luke are done, man. <laughs> yeah, there's no other just way. Gone. There's too many things not working in our favour. We think they cheated. When we were in the car coming here, didn't Jay have a bag of sweets? Nah, that's a ploy. He had the audacity, the cheated little fuck. I'm sorry, uh, we've won this. Do you know how dumb we are? <laughs> it's so dumb, bro. We never even spoke about it. It was just like, yeah, yeah, we'll take the bag. He's feeling it. Yeah, he's fast asleep, though, man. It's really weird, bro. He keeps, like, sucking my dick in his sleep and stuff. We're better to try and get some sleep. We're going to update you on how the f*** that goes. To keep warm, me and Feeling have had to kind of, like, take all our clothes off, pour them in a bowl, and then, like, burn them. So now we're spooning naked, but Feeling keeps putting his, his penis inside me. It's tickling, man. <laughs> we need to see what sort of setup they have. If they have a three bedroom motion, yeah. Yo, scrap it. We know it's in a certain direction over there because Luke said he heard them earlier, so. He's asleep. That's the man. Yeah, shut up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What time is it? 10 to 3. Oh my god. This guy gave up three hours ago. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I did. Last to leave, ain't it? I, I ain't left yet. <laughs> don't listen to Ral, yeah. You guys are with. Alright. I don't think Jay and Phil has fallen them through, but they said they're going to go back to the car and warm it up. But the game is if you got out of bounds, we're the winners. You know what I mean? First person to leave. If we get to the car, there's lights on and they're there. We get the W. I don't think they're that dumb, though. Okay. <laughs> they kindly went and heated up the car and lost. Looks like we get the W, guys. <laughs> Do you want to go on holiday? I don't Where know, you know. Where should we go, bro? Yo, guys, did you guys go out of bounds? <laughs> did you guys go out of bounds? Did you go out of bounds, guys? Yo, should we go Australia, bro? I don't know, bro. <laughs> should we go Australia, bro? Oh, bro, I don't know. <laughs> there you go, so play. Right now, we're back at home. Me and Feeling, we got the W. We secured that fat what? We kind of found a villa. <laughs> <gasps> Should we jump off there and break our legs? It's near Barcelona. Oh, it's Barcelona? I'm so down for that, bro. Yeah. Let me run you through a few pictures. So, we've got a nice seafront view. That is dangerous, bro. Look at that, man. There's real life dolphins in there at the bottom of the pool. They're drowning and they're dying. The cleaner, she used to <laughs> empty all of her like bleach off. She was done with it and all the plastics and rubbish. She just emptied the bin bags and the pool and the dolphins would clean up for her. She'd go, good boys. And a week later, she heard this noise coming from the garden. It was like, <laughs> Straw stuck in there, vent system. There, there, there. Is that a dolphin's got a vent system? Is that AC, bro? Free grab for air conditioning system. Nah, just rob the zoo, bro, and install a dolphin on your wall. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Drill a dolphin on the wall. <laughs> Oh my god, imagine me and you in there we're thinking together, bro, looking into the sea. I'm down for that. <laughs> Why do I feel like this is too good to be true? That's pretty long okay. This is so nice. Located in sea first line with panoramic, just 200 meters from the beach, in a quiet and picturesque place, in a complex called Montegoda Tonsolo, 75 kilometers from Barcelona. 97 kilometers from the French border. So basically in Kent, bro. Don't ever be fooled, okay? They put any words together to make it seem fancy. You get there and there's literally a dog strapped to a car bonnet. <laughs> <laughs> and you're like, what's this? And they go, TV. Like, what's that? That's, and they go, TV. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, remember we have got finessed, you know, bro. They're gonna be missing out. It's time! Ah! It's time, lads and gentlemen, to go on the plane and make our way to Barcelona. Me and feeling, yeah? The villa that we have booked is... Woo! Just arrived at the airport. Me and feeling are currently about to go run to our flight. Yo, what's the point in being early, man? You know, I make an entrance and that. <laughs> Watch out my way, I'm late! Get out of the way! Why are we always late, man? We suck! How do we get to the airport from here? Bro, right, right there. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, end up flying in the sky, yeah, bro. <laughs> always running late, bro. <laughs> I'm not wearing the right boxes for this. My tires right now. Ooh. Who watches the videos? It comes out Christmas, man, but you can have it now. <laughs> so, <laughs> look how big it is on him. <laughs> what do you think is this, bro? And cow shit, dude.
our villa has tour. Yo, let's go, bro. This is where you enter. This is like the hallway. This is the pillar. This is the pillar. If I kick this down and then this one down, the whole thing will come down and crush me. So stay to the end of the video if you want to see that. Next, I'm going to take it to the bedrooms. Here we have the master bedroom. There is a financial amount of real estate. It's just a bedroom. We've got some lights, bike rental, got a scooter over there. And if you look in here, we have our first bathroom. Fresh soap. Don't mind if I do. Thanks for that feeling. Guys, here we have the kitchen. Chilling area, we've got Philips TV from 1966. We have like a little seating area down here, as you can see. Not my colour, I'd rather have blue, to be honest. I'm gonna take it out to the pool. <laughs> Feeling, can you take it from here? Thanks, that, Jay. Guys, we are in the outdoor dining area. We have a nice table. We then have our own uh, built in barbecue area to grill up some nice food. We have a beautiful, beautiful swimming pool. A cupboard, another bathroom, another bathroom, a washroom, a pantry, another bedroom, another bathroom, another bedroom! So it's morning number one. Jay is still in bed right now. I'm just taking a quick walk down to the beachfront. I just typed in on Google Maps, bike rental. I may have found something. I have just woke up to text our feeling saying, Jay, you need to see this. I'm gonna rate the scooter out of 10, one. There is no power in this thing whatsoever. I just handed over 77 euros, yeah, to walk a vehicle up a hill. Oh, here it <laughs> No! The weather is good! I slept like a fucking felt tip man. You ready for the horn? Oh, excuse me, vehicle, get out of the way. <laughs> <laughs> no! Come on, mate! I ain't got all day! Try hill climb test. My nan runs faster than that, and she's got no legs, dude. <laughs> oh my god, the brakes! Brakes don't work, bro. <laughs> by one or I'm not getting my 50 euro deposit back. We have 17 minutes. And it's 30 minute walk away, so the only option is guys I have to get on this. Oh my God. <laughs> the stopping distance is gonna be a whole kilometer. This is sick though. Bro, do you think it's mad that the hood is dropped on the 8th of December at 9pm? absolutely yeah. mental. Bro, bro. <laughs> oh, oh, oh my. Go without me, bro. Just go. I don't know how he's gonna make that. Bye! Bye! Ah! Bro, this thing is so slow. I've got three minutes to get it back. Smash the like button right now. So much has gone into this, and I nearly just got run over by some old bitch driving a Jeep. Smash the like button right now. We came to the conclusion that if we actually want to enjoy ourselves and do anything around this area, you kind of need to travel. So, you see the mopeds? Yo, it's about to be lit. Bro, is that V12? Wow. Whoa, look at it. We're going on a little shop, man. We need to fill out our villa up, yeah, with a bunch of luxury foods, because don't forget, yeah, this is like a luxury holiday. It definitely falls into the luxury bracket. White chocolate filled with Oreo pieces. Are you mad? Frere Roche, guys. These ones are fire. This was introduced in the UK. You would kill every child from hyperactivity. Boles de blat de moro ambil. Chew on them. Chew on rubber. Same thing. Look at this, Renelli's drink. It's called Burn. <laughs> 
We're gonna go for a set of cream and onion and then original tub of Pringles. Can't go wrong with these bad boys, man. I think it's time for a little sit down and chat with Auntie Jimmy Swingley, you know. Europe in general, yeah, for its milk flavors. All I'm saying is the UK sucks for it. Chocolate milk. Look at that packaging. You do not get that in England, no. Kinder Bueno Collins. Are you serious? White chocolate and Scandinavian. Mountain cranberries. You can get cranberries anywhere in the world. Why do we need Scandinavian mountain cranberries? <laughs> you know, you're from a privileged family, yeah, when this is in the cupboard every week, you know. Hola, could I please get one large pepperoni pizza, please? She's like, let me go get my translator. Could I get a, could I make an order for delivery, please? He's gone to get his other translator now because he understands English, but he doesn't understand Dudley English. Yeah. <laughs> He's gonna get his Dudley interpreter. <laughs> Someone from Warsaw comes on. They're like, Oi Mush, what do you want? <laughs> Hello, I'm Domino's Pizza, and what can I get me? <laughs> We're just gonna give you a quick Spanish lesson. Turtle, tortuga. Horse, caballo. Snake, serpiente. Take yourself after. I feel like a fucking baddie, bro. You wanna know what a dog is? <laughs> what time is it? Oh yeah, it's pizza time, bitch. Oh my god. Cheers. Oh. Is your dog? Yeah. I got your hat going on. You got my hat? Mm -hmm. Your outfit's actually fresh, aren't you? Yeah. Yeah. Why is the crust of this stronger than the walls to my house? Give me that airport because no one can see it, so let me flex it. <laughs> no one can see it, so let me flex it. That is the most flexing statement I've ever heard of my life. No one can see that one, so don't use it. No one can see this either, so let me just make a quick Gucci <laughs> choker. <laughs> Look for a holiday, bro. Guys, we have here a little fruit juice that we made up earlier. Mm -hmm. Fruit juice. Fruit juice. You <laughs> went <laughs> and you spat pizza over my face and my shoulder. Did I die in that your reaction as well? You went. Look at that. That is a cola bottle. It smells like a fire. <laughs> I'm not a joke here. <laughs> it smells like a fire. It's like a bonfire. That's why. That's fucking burning. Oh. <laughs> I can't hear out of this ear, bro. Oh, man, bro. Just pig fat in that. <laughs> <laughs> if I left this on one of the walls of my kitchen, I'd come back down the next day and this would be in a different <laughs> continent, bro. It'd collab with the wall. <laughs> <laughs> if you give that to Gatsby. <laughs> oh my god! He'd have four tails. <laughs> and this would be one of them. It put the candle out. Bro, I'm done with this video, you know. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! It was that loud your belt came off. Imagine that across your back. <laughs> ah! Ah! <laughs> no more of that, bro! Do you want to jump off the balcony in the pool? I don't know if this camera's doing it any justice, but that is very f***ing high. Three, two, one. We were hunting for the drone for about half an hour. We've now come back down. Jay's managed to climb up to the rock that I would not climb because I'm sorry. Yeah. When you're down there, if you can see the angle of this rock, to me it just wasn't worth it, but you know what? Jay's manned it out. Look at this shit, man. Let me a luxury holiday, bro. I feel like I'm going to go out in Canada, bro. I've discovered about eight new bugs that have never been discovered before. <laughs> we got the drone! Guys, it's stunt time. Oh, 
<laughs> I was accelerating in the air so when I landed I was shot forward. <laughs> Right, it is a new day. This morning was a little adventure. We had to get the drone back because I crashed it into a bush. If you guys want a drone crashing, just hit me up on Twitter. I can crash all sorts, cars, helicopters. Don't even like beer, but just for the occasion, we're chilling on some rocks, looking out into the ocean, yeah? Absorbing life and appreciating the rocks. So now Romel and Luke, yeah, are sat at home masturbating right now. Three, two, one. Disappears too fast, dude. My bet the beer life, you know. Oh, do you have another one? It's time to go home, right? We've done what we can. We've enjoyed this holiday. Me and Phil have, have had a whale of a time. Thank you so much for watching. We're so, so tired. We'll see you in the next video. Peace. My bitch so violent, she looked like a murder case. And in our hoodies, in case that she run away. Case that she run away. Case that she run away. Case that she run away.